What's up, Comic Book Nation? BD here with your top five stories from the past 24 hours, and today we are packed with Doctor Strange movie goods, a Lion King movie is on the way, and much more in Comic Book Now. If you haven't noticed, ComicBook.com has been pretty magical the past couple days with Doctor Strange all but taking over the site. Yesterday we revealed a couple of new posters and insights from Cumberbatch, Feige, and others. And today we've got even more from the set. It's been revealed. We've talked about a scene from the film, details on Strange's apartment, his relationship with the Ancient One, and how it will stack up against other Marvel Cinematic Universe films. I've talked to a few people about it who have already seen the film and they have done nothing but rave about it, so I am very, very hopeful that this movie lives up to the hype. By the way, there is an Infinity Stone in the movie. The Eye of Agamotto is an Infinity Stone. Yas! <laughs> Your childhood is about to be relived or destroyed, though, by the circle of movie life. The Lion King is getting a live, ad live action adaptation by Jon Favreau. He's set to direct. And now, before you throw your iPhone 7 at, that you're watching us on, uh, take a second to realize Favreau did a just fine job on The Jungle Book, and he also was in charge of the original Iron Man movie back in 2008. So the project is in good hands. Everything the light touches will be Disney's. Nick Fury will likely be making his return to the Marvel Cinematic Universe. How about that? Talking to coming soon, Samuel L. Jackson says that his, the former director of S.H.I.E.L.D., his character, will be brought back somehow, some way, for some reason, by Marvel Studios after sitting out Civil War. Civil War writer Christopher Marcus says that the character sat out the movie because they didn't want him choosing a side, but really, let's be honest, uh, it's probably because he would have just gotten his ass kicked on that airport battlefield uh, with all those superheroes. Anyway, Los Angeles has a Announced a full day of dedicated a full day dedicated to Stan Lee. From now on, Friday, October 28th, will be known as Stan Lee Day, which just so happens to be the opening day of Lee's Kamikaze Expo, which just so happens to be being renamed Stan Lee's Los Angeles Comic Con. Personally, I'm just still waiting on Lee Ferrickson Day to become a thing. Uh, our last topic before we talk nerdy to each other in the comment section, Tony Stark's Stark Expo will be making a return in Spider-Man Homecoming. What? New set photos revealed posters for Stark Expo on the set of the Spidey flick. No word yet on how it will factor into the plot, but we do know that Robert Downey Jr. will be making an appearance in the film. It's a pretty solid role, and I can tell you this. Not only will we be seeing Tony Stark, but we'll be seeing a new Iron Man suit. I told you that, yeah. Spider-Man Homecoming hits theaters July 7, 2017. Now let's turn it over to a few questions from the comment section. What do you guys want to talk about? We didn't talk Walking Dead yet. If you want to talk about that, you know we can do it. We can talk about Spider-Man, whatever you want. Leave your questions in the comment section. I'm going to look at them right now. What do we got? What's going on for Lion King? You missed it. Okay, I'll tell you again. Lion King is getting a live, adap live action adaptation directed by Jon Favreau. Jon Favreau directed The Jungle Book. He directed Iron Man in 2008. Uh, he's a really talented director. He plays Happy Hogan, if you need a face for his name. Uh, he plays Happy Hogan in the Marvel Cinematic Universe. And Happy will be coming back to the MCU. So it's a big, big time in Jon Favreau's life, that's for sure. But the circle of life continues with a live action uh, Lion King movie. Uh, what is Nick Fury, what is the Nick Fury remodel? Return, Nick Fury's return, is uh, he's going to be making a return to the Marvel Cinematic Universe. We don't know when yet. If we had to guess, let's be honest, probably either on an episode of Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D. or an Infinity War, uh, those would be the, maybe, I could see him popping up in Black Panther. That movie's pretty grounded. It seems like a place he could be. Uh, I'm excited for Doctor Strange, says Sean, Sean Ray Rueda. Yeah, go to comicbook.com as soon as we're done here. Look at the number of stories we have. We, t we dropped so many details, even some slight spoilers for the movie, so beware of those. But, but what I'm most typed about is the fact that the Eye of Akimoto is actually an Infinity Stone. I, I can't wait to see the Infinity Stones come together in the Infinity Gauntlet. Um, what else we got? Will the Black Cat ever make it into Spider-Man movie? Not this time, but um, I don't know. It seems like every Marvel character is being brought to life in the movies. Uh, New Lion King, we just talked about it. Sorry, James, uh, or Capil, you should have been here earlier. Spawn reboot. It's been talked about a lot, but I don't know if that's actually going to happen. Um, hopefully it's Jungle. Hopefully it's like Jungle Book and not Tarzan. Talking about The Lion King, yes, uh, it definitely will be because you know why Jon Favreau did not direct Tarzan. He directed Jungle Book, which is a great thing. But it's like, whose voice is going to be Simba? Are we going to get Justin Bieber doing that little, like, like, I'm down. <laughs> uh, so much Doctor Strange, Dustin. Yeah, there's a ton. Uh, let's get a couple more questions. Yeah, no Walking Dead today, Scott. Sorry. Um, what do we got? Who is my favorite Flash, Barry or Wally? Uh, in the comics, Wally's pretty good, but I mean, on the show, we've really explored Barry so much more. 
Uh, I mean, overall, I think it's Barry anyway. Have you read Flashpoint and everything he goes through in that? And all those, oh, there's, there's just, the Barry stories get me better. Um, is Doctor Strange going to Infinity War? Yes, Benedict Cumberbatch confirmed it while talking to Empire Magazine. Benedict Cumberbatch is Doctor Strange will be in Avengers Infinity War. But the big question is, will he be in Thor Ragnarok? I know the answer, but I can't tell you. Sorry. Um, will Star-Lord meet the Avengers? Absolutely. I talked to the Russo brothers at the Civil War junket, and I said... Uh, are the Guardians going to be there? Will the Netflix characters be there? They wouldn't tell me yes or no, but they did say, uh, Anthony Russo specifically said he loves what James Gunn is doing. He is most specifically excited to have, to work with Star-Lord in Infinity War, which means uh, Star-Lord will be there. The Guardians, Vin Diesel also confirmed this on Facebook. So the Guardians of the Galaxy will be in Avengers Infinity War, which we all assumed, considering how many times do we have to hear them say it's the culmination of the Marvel Cinematic Universe to date. Yes, that includes the Guardians. Uh, so yeah. Uh, who's the Spider-Man villain? Vulture. Yeah. Uh, Michael Keaton is playing Vulture. Will we ever see Nightwing anywhere? Absolutely. He's, DC knows they have to bring him in. They have to know that. Warner Brothers knows that. Uh, and new Flash and Hour crossover. Yeah, this year's Flash and Hour crossover will be with Supergirl and Legends of Tomorrow. It's going to be a four-day event. Get hyped for it. Uh, that's all we have time for today, guys. Thank you so much for being a part of the show. Before we sign off, I want to remind you that our third episode of Major Issues is live on comicbook.com right now. It's at the top of the page. It's easy to find. And with each episode, you get a chance to win a totally free vintage copy of the first appearance of your favorite characters. So be sure to head over and check that out. Uh, today we had a Misty Night episode. Yeah, it's excited. It's exciting. Uh, thanks so much for being part of today's show, like I said. Uh, for all your geek fixes, follow us across all of social media at Comic Book on Twitter and at Comic Book Now on Instagram. On behalf of Comic Book Nation, I'm Brandon Davis. I think that went well. Yeah? Scotch, scotch, scotch. Scotch, scotch, scotch.